Good morning guys. So recently I started doing the um, Arbon 30 days to healthy living challenge. I started this Monday. So it's day five. Um, so I just kind of want to take you guys along with me during my day and show you guys what I eat um, while like doing this. It really isn't that much of a change from like what I regularly eat besides cutting out coffee and alcohol which is the hardest part and dairy so no cheese for me it's been super fun but um no it really hasn't been that bad but um every morning i start off with this green shot i know it's huge i just put more water in it because it's easier to get everything to dissolve um but it really doesn't taste that bad so i can definitely drink this whole thing without there being an issue um but it's just what I was showing you guys over here. So in my greens shot, I put um, this Digestion Plus, which is basically probiotics and three biotics. It supports like gut health, um, all that fun stuff. I put in this healthy skin elixir. It's just basically like a vegan collagen and it has an acai berry taste which is really good and then I put in a scoop of this greens balance which is um basically like a whole bunch of like veggies and um like antioxidants and it basically like helps support the immune system and the digestive system all that and then I just put a ton of water in there because it's really good to start off your day with a ton of water and I just down it and then I'm going to show you guys what I do next. Okay, so I usually take that first thing in the morning. Um, it says to like take it at least 30 minutes um, before you eat. So I always take that, get dressed to do an outdoor workout or like an at-home workout since you know we're not allowed to go to the gym right now and then i will shower and then make breakfast so i'm gonna go get dressed for my workout and then go get that done potato hash there's uh sweet potatoes onion garlic kale uh what else did i put in there <laughs> two over easy eggs they are cage free because that's what they're supposed to be for all this and then um my herbal tea with 
of pomegranate fizz and a splash of almond milk. And that's breakfast. How is it? It's delicious. Okay, so it's a little bit later. I'm starting to get hungry, but honestly, I'm really not in like the mood to make anything elaborate. So I'm just gonna make a little smoothie. Um, I'm gonna use some of this chocolate protein powder. I'm also gonna throw in a little bit of cacao powder to make it some extra chocolatey, some chia seeds, almond milk, a banana, it's frozen, um, some almond butter, and then a little bit of spinach. I'm just gonna throw all that in there, blend it up, and yeah. thick and creamy. So good. Okay, so this is my snack before I uh, decide to make dinner. <laughs> but um, I just cut up some celery. I like cut up a whole two stalks of celery for like the week and just put it in this container. Um, and I've just been like snacking on it throughout the week. And I made some homemade hummus. I can link that recipe for you guys down below. But yeah, this is just my snack. Um, I eat chips with it, whatever other veggies I have. I've been eating broccoli with it. This is just what I have cut up right now. So yeah, and some soda water. And Summer's eyeing my snack. No, you cannot have this. This is not for you. I'm making dinner. Um, I'm making the sesame ginger salmon. Um, I think I've posted this recipe on my Instagram before, but I just need to marinate the salmon first for 30 minutes before I bake it. So I'm gonna do that now. Um, usually I use brown sugar for the marinade and the glaze, but since I'm not eating sugar right now, I'm gonna use just a little bit of agave. Um, can we focus? And then I have my toasted sesame oil, tamari, which is gluten-free, some rice vinegar, some sriracha, and then some frozen garlic and ginger. Um, so I'm just gonna whip up the marinade, let that sit for 30 minutes and then we'll be back to cook everything else. And I will post the entire recipe in the description box down below so you guys can make this if you want. Super good, the only way I can get Casey to eat salmon because he only likes salmon in sushi form, so yeah.
two minutes and then we will continue with dinner. Also, I forgot to take my vitamins earlier. I take two of these Tula Balance Beauty gummies. Um, it's just like probiotics and then like hair, skin, and nails. And then I take one of the magnesium caps. It helps me sleep um, and like, yeah, it just <laughs> kind of helps me like with like my insomnia and stuff like that. Um, and it helps like relax muscles, supports immune health and all that. So I'm gonna take those. And I still have a discount code with Tula. Um, I'll put it right here on the screen. It is holistic list 15 and you can use that code on all your Tula products. Save you some money. Um, not sponsored, just I really do like these. So that's what I've been taking, obviously. They're almost done. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna make the glaze for the salmon too. And I'm gonna put that on top before I put it in the oven. Um, I just put two more little like, cubes of that ginger. what it should look like preheating the oven to 400 and then I'm just gonna pop that in there for about 30 minutes and then we will be ready to eat Trader Joe's brown rice. It's like the easiest thing to make. All you do is just poke a little hole. And then you can microwave it in the bag for three minutes. Easiest brown rice ever. So I doubled that glaze recipe just so I can put a little extra on top of like the salmon and the veggies and the rice. <laughs> just so everything has some good flavor. dinner so we got the salmon with all the glaze some brown rice again easiest brown rice to make brown rice usually takes like 45 minutes to cook up that's just three minutes in the microwave lifesaver some asparagus some soda water and some trashy love island Okay, so every night after dinner, I've been having um, some tea, so I do these two. This is the traditional 
Medicinals uh, Nighty Night Extra. This helps me sleep because I have insomnia and I can never sleep. <laughs> and then I have this um, Arbonne Essentials Detox Tea. It really just helps to like settle my stomach after dinner. Um, it helps me like digest everything. So yeah, that's what I'm gonna have. I have my tea and my dessert. I've been back on the Who chocolate life. Um, we already finished the salty dark. So we're moving on to the uh, cashew butter one. I don't know if I've tried this one yet, but I'm just gonna have a couple squares of that, my tea and get ready for bed. What are you, what are you going crazy about? What's in the couch? Are you just grumpy? Are you tired? Yeah. What's in here? What's in here? Let me see. Let me see it. There's literally nothing in this in this crack. I don't know why you're going crazy. Excuse you. Do you want to be in here? No? No, oh, thank you. <laughs> oh my goodness, you're crazy. Ow. Oh. Ow. You're very... You're very rough with your kisses. I'm getting nibbles over here. Okay, okay, thank you. Okay, let's go with that now. All right, guys, that's all I have for you today. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this little what I eat in a day while doing the Arbon 30 Days to Healthy Living. Um, if you guys did enjoy this video, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe before you leave. Um, and let me know in the comments what you guys want to see from me next. And I hope you guys are all doing okay during quarantine. I know we're still all stuck in this amazing time together. But, um, I hope you guys are all well and are being safe and healthy and don't forget to take care of yourselves. Alright guys, I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!